Not seen much of you in the pre-season, Neil. Uh, have you been a little bit busy? Yes, uh, I've got the opportunity to uh, go to Namibia and be their defence coach leading into the World Cup. It's a real opportunity for me as a, as a, as a coach and I've, en I've enjoyed the first month. So how did it come about then? Uh, Nubi I can't just say it, I'm going to leave this on tape so people can have a giggle at me trying to say Namibia. How did you become Namibian defence coach? How did well, it come about? Well, uh, a gentleman called Alan Solomon has uh, really instigated the whole thing. Uh, he's somebody that I'd met in my time in Northern Ireland and we've built a relationship over, up over the years. Uh, it, there was a potential for me to go to Portugal but with them not qualifying for the World Cup that, that fell by the wayside and uh, it just got just run me out of the blue, told me about Namibia, uh, told me that they'd, uh, they wanted a defence coach, I jumped at the opportunity and it all happened really quickly after that point. And obviously you can see just from the look on your face you're enjoying it. Well I've, it's, a, it's an opportunity, it's an unexpected opportunity and uh, I've, I've, I've enjoyed it, I've enjoyed the first month like I said and I'm looking forward to going back, we go back to Cape Town next week, next week for 10 days then back to Vinduk, the capital of Namibia and then on to the World Cup, I wouldn't enjoy that. And it's um, balancing okay with the Doncaster Knights Stewarts for this season? Yeah, yeah, I've, uh, I've talked to Brett in depth about it, he's quite comfortable with it although it's not ideal uh, I've, we, I'm working through Brett at the moment, we, we, we're trying to influence the defence uh, with the Doncaster squad. Uh, fortunately at the moment it's working quite well uh, and uh, if it continues like that then uh, yeah, I don't see any problems. But uh, not so much a problem, you think about it in a positive way, it's a, a development tool for yourself and for Doncaster Knights with you being on a bigger stage because Everybody spends a whole life learning, especially yeah, well, in sport. Well, already I've had uh, meetings with the uh, uh, is it Paddy O'Brien, the controller of international referees, and I'd never go, I'd never get to that if it, if I, for, if it wasn't for this involvement with Namibia, and that's that surely that's going to be good for uh, for Doncaster Rugby Union, and uh, I'm looking forward to putting into practice some of the things I'm learning and I'm finding out uh, uh, putting into practice with the Knights.